Here it is from Daniel chapter 8, verses 23 to, through 26. These are the signs of the Antichrist. And in the latter time of their kingdom, when the transgressors have reached their fullness, a king shall arise, having fierce features, who understands sinister schemes. His power shall be mighty, but not by his own power. He shall destroy fearfully and shall prosper and thrive. He shall destroy the mighty and also the holy people. Through his cunning, he shall cause deceit to prosper under his rule, and he shall exalt himself in his heart. He shall destroy many in their prosperity. He shall even rise against the prince of princes, but he shall be broken without human means. And the vision of the evenings and the mornings which was told is true. Therefore, seal up the vision, for it refers to many days in the future. Now, Daniel here is quoting an angel, and that angel is giving him the keys. Let's look at each one. A king shall arise. When you get the, the understanding, it's a, it's a king. Uh, it's an absolute ruler, and you can call them emperor, you can call them a Caesar, you can call them a Fuhrer, you can call them a chairman, you can call them all kinds of things, but you've got to understand, he has absolute rule. When he makes a decree, it becomes the law of the land. Second, his power shall be mighty, but not by his own power. He'll have unusual things. The book of Revelation talks about he'll have the ability to give signs and wonders. He'll be so unusual in his power that even the elect can be deceived by what he's doing. 